My name is Meryl Metcalf, Head of Living With, the Patient Syndicated Research Team at the Research Partnership. NASH is short for non-alcoholic steatohepatitis. It's a condition where fat accumulates in the liver, and this causes inflammation and damage to liver cells. It's a condition that is typically associated with insulin resistance, metabolic syndrome, and obesity. It's one of the most common liver conditions. However, it is poorly understood and commonly misdiagnosed. Living with NASH is a patient-syndicated study that we conducted with US patients recently. We developed some really interesting insights, not only on patient unmet needs and their attitudes and behaviors towards NASH, but also um, a really good outline of their patient journey from pre-diagnosis to how they're being currently managed. NASH patients tend to be young to middle aged and they suffer from a host of health issues such as obesity, type 2 diabetes, high blood pressure, and high cholesterol. About half of them are asymptomatic in terms of NASH symptoms. So some of them might experience fatigue or weakness, but these overlap with their other comorbidities. So by the time that they do get diagnosed with NASH, it really comes as a surprise to them because this is something that they were not expecting and was never flagged. When patients visit the doctor, what they're really expecting is an explanation of the treatments that they can receive for NASH. But because there's no currently available treatments, they tend to receive advice on lifestyle, such as you know, reducing alcohol intake, exercising more, or um, having healthier diets. Having said that, patients really do want to understand more about their condition. So three quarters of patients at diagnosis wish they knew more about NASH, such as what's actually causing it um, and what treatments they can have for it. Things like non-invasive diagnostic tools or just better diagnosis um, are things that are also really important to patients. NASH is a really huge opportunity for pharma companies uh, just because of the fact that prevalence is increasing but there are no current treatments out there. Um, so this is a really underserved patient population um, that really need assistance. But having said that, for companies to really launch their products successfully, they do need to understand the patients um, as well as patient needs thoroughly. If you want to find out more about living with NASH, please check out our website or contact me directly.